body, there's like this instinct that kicks in that makes you want to protect it, even though your brain is like, no, no, we're not ready for this. This was always the plan. If this happened, you promised your boyfriend that we would do this. So it was really scary to be receiving all this conflicting pressure from medical staff and your body to not do it, and then being pressured by your partner to do it. It felt like I didn't even have a choice. It really felt like I wasn't even allowed to consider what would happen um, if I didn't. And I'm reiterating over and over, I mean, look at my appointments. This was always what I was going to do. I was constantly taking the steps to end the pregnancy. But it's really scary when somebody is forcing you to do it. Um, and I did have moments of weakness where I would cry and say things like, Okay, but honestly, like, can we just consider, like, what if we didn't do it? Still gonna do it, but can we just consider what would happen if I didn't? And he would say, like, no, it's, it's not even a question. You're gonna ruin my life if you do that. It, that would be the worst thing to ever happen to me. But as along the lines of things that he would say. And at one point, he even said that he would break up with me if I didn't do it, and that he would resent me and the potential child. And um, that's really stuck with me. However, um, before we do it, uh, I, I hate doing this. Uh, I would like to very, very quickly for the last and final time just kind of be clear about uh, you know everything that happened, if that's cool. Uh, I'm sure we're all pretty exhausted by it by now, um, and normally I wouldn't want to talk about this stuff, but I feel like if I don't, I'm gonna be asked about it for years. Uh, so I just wanna be really clear with you guys, because I saw some confusion. Uh, God, it even sucks to say. Uh, I mean, I'm, I saw you guys pretty much all assuming it, like, the podcast is not coming back. Um, I don't want to get into private details too much because I that boys. makes me uncomfortable. Boy, no, boys, boys, support boys. Support boys. boys support boys. We have boy support boys merch that we're both wearing. Look at it. Look at our body right now. Look, if you're an audio listener, look at us. Guys, look. Look. Thanks for watching these videos, you guys. I know that they're really important and there's a lot of information in them, but it's still cool that you watch them. It's been a long year. Long two years. Yeah. But we're in God's country. We're out here in God's country. Things aren't so bad out here in God's country. It ain't so bad. Well, next year's a little bit better. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. Don't put it in. People will think I'm faking. No, they're not. I'm fucking sick of people's. No. Just be good to people, please. Um, we're all doing our best out here in God's country. Hope you guys are doing well, too. I'm going to go have some cocoa right now and probably play some spelling game that my mom's going to cheat at. <laughs> Don't cheat. Okay, let's go inside. I love you. Love you too, Mom. <laughs>